Hello, my name's Shane. I'm security, but I've also have the safety swimmer role for the submarine operations. I'm an ex-Royal Marine. I work for Prialvo Maritime Security, so I have a lot of experience with boats and also previous experience working with submarines. As my role as swimmer, um, it's two hand. I'm also medically trained and I'm the in case of emergency. Uh, the chase boat can go in at speed, slow down, I can get on as a precaution and then I can take commands off the pilot and if we need to do anything on board, safety wise, I can carry out the pilot instructions. Once the sub is in the water and it's done its checks, I will remove the cover and also the tag lines and ultimately the bridle so it can operate in the water. I wasn't expecting to do it, I got picked on the immobilisation phase and it is a very interesting job. We've had to do it obviously a day, we've had to do it in calm conditions, but we've also had to do it when it was quite rough and we've had to do it at night, which has been a little bit uh, testing. So my previous training as a Royal Marine has put me in good stead. The communications, understanding quickly what to do and in a case of emergency, being able to react accordingly. Getting the, uh, the sub off the hook uh, can be quite dangerous at times, certainly if there's a bit of rough weather. You have got to be quick, but also safe, unhooking and also making sure all the straps and taglines are free of any uh, data collection equipment on board. This has certainly been a fantastic opportunity for me, working with the ocean scientists, like-minded people, and getting involved with these submarine operations. A once in a lifetime opportunity to work with Necton, and hopefully going forward, I'll be able to come back and work on future missions.